1978, a team of MIT neuroscientists discovered something that made the U.S. military classify their findings for over a decade. They found that a specific breathing rhythm could shift human brainwave patterns from beta, the frequency of stress and scattered thinking, to theta, the exact frequency Buddhist monks enter after years of meditation. But here's what they didn't publish. This wasn't a new discovery. Vedic texts from 3000 BC documented this exact protocol, calling it pranayama of divine alignment. The pattern? Four seconds in, seven seconds hold, eight seconds out. When practiced correctly, 73% of test subjects reported a measurable shift in what they called opportunity magnetism within 14 days. What I'm about to show you isn't meditation. It's a tactical protocol that physically changes how your nervous system responds to the very moments your manifestations try to arrive. Over the past decade, breathwork has moved from ancient monasteries into the world's most elite performance labs. From Wim Hof's cold exposure protocols to the classified methods used by Navy SEAL Team 6 operators, every high-stakes environment has discovered the same truth. Breath controls everything. But the 478 pattern stands alone. Here's why. Dr. Andrew Huberman at Stanford documented that this specific rhythm activates your vagus nerve, the superhighway between your brain and your gut, where 95% of your serotonin lives. When you hold for seven seconds at full lung capacity, you're triggering what neurologists call the parasympathetic override. Think of this like switching a high-performance engine from fifth gear straight into neutral while it's still moving. For a brief moment, your sympathetic nervous system, the part that keeps you in fight or flight, goes offline. And in that gap, your subconscious mind becomes reprogrammable. Harvard researchers in 2019 used fMRI scans and found that subjects practicing this pattern showed increased activity in the prefrontal cortex, the decision-making center while simultaneously decreasing amygdala activity by 37%. Translation? You become mission-ready, clear, decisive, magnetic to the exact opportunities you've been visualizing but couldn't execute on. But here's the problem nobody talks about. You've done the vision boards. You've repeated the affirmations. You've watched your bank account waiting for the manifestation. And maybe something does show up. A job lead, a business opportunity, a potential relationship. But when that moment arrives, when you need to be sharp and confident, your body betrays you. Your heart races. Your mind goes blank. You second-guess yourself. You freeze. This pattern plays out thousands of times every day. A man visualizes a partnership deal for months. The meeting finally happens. 20 minutes in, his chest tightens. His thoughts scatter. He walks out having sabotaged the very thing he'd been manifesting. The deal falls through. $40,000 in potential revenue, gone. Not because the manifestation didn't work, but because his nervous system wasn't calibrated to receive it. Here's the truth most manifestation teachers won't tell you. Attracting opportunities means nothing if your body is stuck in survival mode. If you're trapped in that stressed, reactive beta brainwave state, you'll repel what you're trying to attract. Your biology becomes your bottleneck. Enter the 478 Manifestation Protocol. Not from a guru. From Dr. Andrew Wheel a Harvard-trained physician who studied with indigenous shamans in South America and brought this technique back to Western medicine. The protocol is deceptively simple. Inhale through your nose for four seconds. Hold for seven. Exhale completely through your mouth for eight. But the sequence matters. Four seconds activates your sympathetic nervous system, just enough to wake up your focus. 
Seven seconds at the hold is where the magic happens. You're oxygenating your prefrontal cortex while simultaneously building carbon dioxide tolerance, which sounds technical, but here's what it does. It trains your body to stay calm under pressure. That eight second exhale, that's your nervous system's reset button. Neuroscientist Dr. Jack Feldman at UCLA discovered that exhales longer than your inhales send a direct signal to your brainstem. Thread over, stand down. In that eight second window, your heart rate drops, your cortisol levels decrease, and your brain shifts from reactive to receptive. This is the state where manifestation moves from theory to physics. You're no longer hoping something shows up. You're becoming the frequency that pulls it toward you. The protocol works because it hijacks your autonomic nervous system, the part that runs on autopilot. Most manifestation techniques try to use willpower and conscious thought. This goes deeper. This rewires the operating system. All right, we're going to do this together right now. Sit up straight, feet flat on the floor. If you're driving, bookmark this and come back. This requires your full attention. Place your tongue on the ridge of tissue behind your upper front teeth. Keep it there the entire time. This is an ancient yogic position that completes an energetic circuit in your body. Cycle one, calibration. Close your eyes. Exhale completely through your mouth. Make a whoosh sound. Empty your lungs. Now, close your mouth. Inhale quietly through your nose for four seconds. One, two, three, four. Hold that breath. Seven seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now exhale completely through your mouth for eight seconds. That same whoosh sound. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's one cycle. Notice what you feel. Maybe slight lightheadedness. That's oxygen flooding your prefrontal cortex. That's normal. Cycle two, visualization integration. Same pattern. Exhale completely to empty. Inhale through your nose for four seconds. As you do, visualize white light entering through the crown of your head. One, two, three, four. Hold for seven seconds. See that light filling your chest, your solar plexus, the center of your personal power. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale for eight. Visualize any tension, any resistance, any fear leaving your body as dark smoke. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cycle three, manifestation imprinting. Empty your lungs. Inhale for four seconds. This time bring to mind the exact situation you're manifesting. Don't think about wanting it. See yourself having it. One, two, three, four. Hold for seven. Feel the emotions of that reality. The confidence, the certainty, the calm power of someone who's already there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale for eight seconds. Release any attachment to how it happens. Just anchor the frequency. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cycle four, integration, last cycle. Exhale completely. Inhale through your nose four seconds. This time, no visualization, just pure breath. One, two, three, four. Hold for seven. Feel your entire body calibrated, alert but calm, focused but fluid. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale for eight. You're locking this state into your nervous system. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Open your eyes. You just completed the 478 manifestation protocol. Four cycles. Notice how your body feels different than it did seven minutes ago. This is why elite performers use breathwork before high-stakes moments. Not manifestation coaches. Operators. Navy SEALs practice tactical breathing before missions. UFC fighters use it between rounds. Neurosurgeons use it before 12-hour surgeries. They don't call it manifestation. They call it mission readiness. But the mechanism is identical. They're training their biology to stay resourceful in the exact moments that determine outcomes. The applications are tactical and immediate. Use this protocol before job interviews, before difficult conversations, before negotiations, before any moment where you need your nervous system working for you instead of against you. The four cycles take less than five minutes. But in those five minutes, you're shifting from reactive to receptive, from scattered to centered, from survival mode to manifestation mode. This isn't about believing it works. This is about what happens to your autonomic nervous system when you practice a specific breathing pattern that's been documented by both 3,000-year-old Vedic texts and modern neuroscience labs. Here's your protocol. Four cycles of four, seven, eight breathing. Morning, before you check your phone. Do it for 21 days. That's the minimum time required for neuroplasticity, for your brain to form new neural pathways. This isn't about believing it works. This is about installing a new operating system in your nervous system. Comment below right now. I commit. Three words. Then come back after seven days and report what shifted. Not what you manifested. How you felt in high-pressure moments. That's the real indicator. In the next video, the advanced version of this protocol gets revealed. It's called the Vagus Nerve Activation Sequence. And it combines the 478 pattern with specific body positions that amplify the parasympathetic response by 300%. But that's only for those who've completed the 21-day foundation first. So hit subscribe, complete your 21 days, and you'll get access to the advanced protocol. Remember, manifestation isn't about attracting what you want. It's about becoming someone whose nervous system can receive it. The 478 protocol is your reprogramming tool. Deploy it.